great riff, isn't it? Hey guys, my name is Tom Helwig and today we're going to play Peace Frog by the Doors. And we really understood why the song was called Peace Frog, but anyway. Tips are available at my Patreon page, as always. Let's get to work. Okay, first off, let's start with the well-known intro. <laughs> It's basically a G power chord, thump, third finger, little finger, then mute the G string with your little finger, first finger, third fret, the first and second string. Now Robbie Krieger actually plays this chord with a bar, but I do not recommend that because the chance that you will press down your G string and play a G minor is very big. It's very hard to do, I really don't know how he does it. I'm gonna use my thumb, it's much easier for me. Let's take a look at the strumming. Now the first three strums you want to press down your chord, down, up, down. Then you want to mute. And the last strum, you want to play the low E string, quite soft. So it's... That's basically what you have to do. Let's give that a try. One, two, three, and it's... Then a bit further up in the verse there are a couple of nice riffs that Robbie plays straight through the vocals. It starts off with this very bluesy lick. <laughs> it's very bluesy. Use your second finger, slide up two frets, and slide back and a pull off. And then we're gonna bend the second fret, one fret up on the G string, and then release and another pull off. going to end with so it's three four one then we have a nice sequence but it works kind of nice then slide up to the sixth fret Let's play that whole bit, see if you can play along. Start after the first beat. One, two, three, four, one. Then the second verse is pretty much like the first verse, except the ending is a little bit different. Again, we have the blues riff. We got this bend, seven to nine, pull off, then an eye is bent, seven to nine, onto the B chord, and we're onto the solo. It starts with a very funky riff. Slow. You have to play that four times in a row. Then it's on to the E minor. Nice part. And it's on to the solo. Let's break it down. Start on the 18th fret. Slow. Then we're going to bend 17 to the 19th fret. 
Reminds me a little bit of like Chuck Berry. Then it's a bend and a release and yet another bend. Like this. Then he continues. Next part, another sequence. Slow. And then a very mysterious and a bit sad part. D7 sus4. And the last part of the song is basically the riff that you have to play endlessly. And that's it. all the parts for the song Peace Frog by the Doors. What an awesome riff. You can play it like endlessly if you want. I will see you next time.